The 15th annual pink test is underway at the SCG to raise vital funds for breast cancer. Jane McGrath, the wife of cricket legend Glenn McGrath, died from breast cancer in 2008. In her memory, the pink test was founded to raise money for breast cancer. Glenn McGrath is the co-founder and president of the McGrath Foundation and he joins me now live. Glenn, thank you so much for joining us. The pink test is now in its 15th year. How big of a milestone is that? Yeah, hi, Tanette, uh, Tanika. It's um, absolutely amazing to think 15 pink tests. Uh, I think back to that first one in 2009. We didn't really know what to expect, and the way that test went on, it just got pinker and pinker and bigger and better and as it went on, and then from then on, it's just grown. And the way, you know, firstly, both cricket teams, the, the Australian and the touring team, has got behind it, plus everyone here at the SCG, but including the, the crowd, and uh, the Australian public, it's been absolutely incredible. So, yeah, very, very proud. Yeah, you, you must be so humbled by the support that you get from Australians every year and how people really get involved. Oh, exactly right. Uh, you yeah, know, this is something close to my heart and, and my family's, but I think there's not too many people in Australia that haven't been touched by breast cancer in some way, shape or form, whether it's a, a family member or a close friend. And we're about support and making a positive difference in people's lives. So I guess they feel that connection and uh, the money they give makes a massive difference to so many people's lives. How can people donate? Because you don't have to just attend the game, you can do it virtually, is that right? Yeah, exactly right. Uh, we have the virtual pink seat campaign happening again. So you can jump online, pinktest.com.au, buy your virtual pink seat or quite a few of them. Uh, you get a, a graphic with your names on the seat you can post on your social media but it's a great way to support loved ones that have been through breast cancer or loved ones that aren't here anymore or just support what i think is a great cause so uh, yeah get your virtual pink seat as well as players are donating their baggy pink caps their signed shirts uh, and also robbie williams has donated his pink outfit from the afl grand final so there's a lot on that site, uh, pinktest.com.au. Absolutely incredible support. Look, just finally, before we let you go, Australia has already wrapped up the series. Is Australia particularly good at the moment, do you think, or the Proteas not playing their best? Well, it's probably been a little bit of both, to be honest. Australia have played some, some incredible cricket, so you can't take it away from them to be in the dominant position they are. We were expecting a lot more from South Africa. They were the number two ranked test team in the world, and... They haven't really fired. Their batsmen uh, have been pretty ordinary, to be honest. And uh, the, the bowlers, they've got a world-class world bowling attack. Unfortunately, they were off song a little bit down in Melbourne. They bowled OK here yesterday on day one. Um, so we're hoping they'll lift for this game and make it a, a good close contest. Glenn McGrath, lovely to speak with you. Thank you for joining us and all the best with the pink test. No worries. Thank you. And thank you to your viewers for the support they've given the foundation over the years. Really appreciate it. Thank you.